Right, the penultimate race from Kempton is the Warren Fire Stayers Handicap for uh, an Auto 85 event for three horses up. One is Canada John Morgan. Uh, two is in the pen, Kevin Minigan. Three, Golden Gate OB1, which is the favourite. And Captain Paddy Alex Cherry is the fourth horse. Four horses here at Kempton. Now at the start, we're just waiting for them to load. And away they go. And quickly away was in the pink, also well away Canada, but on the rail the grey horse Captain Paddy goes to lead them. So Captain Paddy the leader for Alex Cherry from Canada on that one's out, so then now goes to the front. Then comes in the pink for Kevin Meanigan at the back of the field, Golden Gate for Obi Wan. So they're all pulling hard here, not much pace on as Captain Paddy goes back into the lead from Canada in second, then forms Golden Gate, who's moving up on the inside of Canada. The green colours out wide is in the pink and it's Captain Paddy the Grey Horse for Alex Cherry who leads them from in the pink in second for Kevin Meanigan on the rail is Golden Gate for Obi-Wan in those yellow colours and the black colours and the white cap is Canada for John Morgan so Captain Paddy as the camp boss stands for the first time they still got two circuits to go after this uh, after this uh, circuit and it's Captain Paddy the leader from in the pink in second Golden Gate is on the inside of Canada and the four horses only separated by about two lengths as Captain Paddy takes him out on their second uh, penultimate circuit so a long way to go and it's Alex Cherry's Captain Paddy leads from Canada in second who's in between uh, in the pink on his outside and on his inside Golden Gate for everyone so it's the grey horse with the orange cap and orange sleeves Captain Paddy who leads Green colours of in the pink back in second. He's on the outside of Golden Gate and Canada just behind those in between the two of them. There's only three lengths first to last year as Captain Paddy still takes them along from Golden Gate in second. Uh, in between horses, the black colours of Canada and out wide in the pink. There's gone three wide most of the race. Um, might make a difference later on. Uh, Kempton draw is a factor and going three wide is probably not ideal. Captain Paddy leads from in the pink in second. Canada is on the outside of Golden Gate who has the rails run but the uh, three lengths first to last year as the grey horse Captain Paddy still takes up along. So Captain Paddy comfortable leader from in the pink in second not growing a great pace. Canada is still back in third with a Golden Gate on his inside as the four horses come to the home stretch for the first time or for the second time. This is the penultimate time. Next time will be the the final circuit it's Captain Paddy who leads from in the pink in second so get to the two furlong pole with Captain Paddy now about three lengths clear of in the pink in second there's about four lengths back now to Golden Gate in third who has Canada on his outside and there's about six lengths first to last as Captain Paddy takes him past the furlong pole and past the stands for the penultimate time it's Captain Paddy a comfortable leader for Alex Cherry is about to go off on their final circuit Captain Paddy from in the pink in second. They pass the winning post for the penultimate time. Head off on their final circuit. To one mile left to travel. Captain Paddy, the leader from in the pink in second. Then comes Golden Gate on the inside of Canada. It's about six lengths first to last year as Captain Paddy for Alex Cherry is still the leader from in the pink in second. No real move from anything yet. Golden Gate is still on the inside of Canada and they're all travelling well. So all have some sort of a chance as Captain Paddy takes him along for Alex Cherry. Two lengths back to in the pink for Kevin Meanigan, who now is on the rail after going wide for most of the first two circuits. Golden Gate is on the inside of Canada for John Morgan. And they're starting to close up now. There's only about four lengths first to last as Captain Paddy still the leader for Alex Cherry. So the grey horse leads from the black horse in second with the green colours in the pink, Kevin Minigan. Two lengths back to the yellow colours of Golden Gate, who's on the inside of Canada. But now there's only about a three lengths first to last and they've really started to bunch up now with about four four lengths left to travel. It's Captain Paddy who's not very far clear now as in the pink comes up on his outside and then comes Golden Gate in Canada, also looming large. And you can throw a blanket over them, they almost fall in the line as they start to turn for home here. Captain Paddy on the inside from in the pink. They then comes Golden Gate in Canada and they literally are four in a line now as in the pink goes to the front for Kevin Meanigan. 
pink. So it's in the pink from Golden Gate in second. Captain Paddy is a uh, tapful room and um, quarter bit flat footed is Canada at the back of the field. It's in the pink. Lily is from Golden Gate in second. Canada is getting going for John Morgan. Uh, Captain Paddy's probably cried enough back and forth. It's in the pink for Kevin Mini, but yeah, comes Canada for John Morgan. It's in the pink, but Canada is moving up on his outside. It's in the pink, still has the advantage, but in the pink is moving up on his outside. He's going to pick it up soon, and in the pink is the third and left to travel as we pass by Canada, and Canada takes it up with half a foot and left to travel and starts to draw clear. Canada is going to win the marathon event here at Campton for John Morgan. In the pink was back in second for Kevin Meenigan. Back in third was Golden Gate, and the long time leader, Captain Paddy, finishes in fourth. So Canada, suited by the step up in trip, wins relatively comfortably in the end. From in the pink, who did travel wide for a lot of the race, might have affected the result a little bit. And in the pink, Canada wins for John Morgan. In the pink, second for Kevin Minigan. Then came Coldgate and Captain Paddy.